What's up, guys? We're by Franklin Street and North 15. We're in, um, we actually, we're in, we in Williamsburg slash Greenpoint. We like in the border in between, you know? So we over here. Wait one second, I'm gonna take a shot at this location. Hold on. All right, so we over here about to walk back because I got to, um, I got to take the, um, we got to walk back because I got to take the G. So I'm going to take the 32 and get off at Greenpoint and take the G for 730. So we're trying to uh, find a, a, a stop where I could get the um, the, the 32 because the stop that I got off, I could get from back that side, but I can really get it from the other side. So let's try Oh, uh, people ask me how I'm feeling. I feel a little bit better from earlier, so thanks for asking. I feel a little bit better from earlier, so thanks for asking. I just gotta take it easy and not overdo it today, so yeah. I'm just walking a little slow, but you know, it's because of the heat and the weather, you know? So the next stop is, come on, come on. Shut down my phone, I'm not even focus on him right now. Yeah, so the next bus is gonna come in 17 minutes. Um, The 17 minute bus is at sitting there. So the stop is at Franklin Street, but we at, we're gonna walk back to Canton North 12. So we two blocks down, actually. So I'm gonna take the 20, the N, the B20, the B32 and get off at Franklin Street and Greenpoint Avenue. Yeah, so we here, we gonna look at some franchises for my business that I'm putting up. And I got a little bit of announcement about that. Um, we actually gonna be starting up, we think about doing a basketball program for boys and girls. It's a basketball camp where they can come and show their talent. And we actually looking for, what's that gonna be? So we actually looking for like a warehouse to build up a basketball court indoor. So we're trying to like feel like, you know, in a workout area. So it's a it's a good opportunity for people to show off their talents and stuff like that. So um I like basketball and one of these days I'm gonna buy out I'm gonna um name my basketball team and we're gonna go to different tour different nations. As you can see I'm right behind this location right here. So we gotta turn we gotta um tour different nations whatever I'm gonna um build that up where people could come see the um players and college recruitments and stuff like that. Um I will be attending the New York um business expedition on June first. I will be um actually um doing the program for the self employment industry. So we're gonna be there. Um Five Fest Production Management will be there and we will be touring around different business brands and 
getting them to partner up with us on certain projects, you feel me? So we were actually looking into that right now. So it's like, it's a big opportunity, but we're gonna get it done, you feel me? That's how it is. So like I was talking about, right? So we doing this because it helps, you know, it helps the community, it helps give back, whatever. So we try to like do something that will help the community and help to ease the problems around the nation, you know? So I'm gonna develop a basketball team and it's a boys and girls league. Um, it's called the, the Blessed Dream Foundation League. So it's an indoor basketball court find a warehouse space to build that so i'm gonna develop that and um sponsor you know people different brands are gonna come through so it's a good opportunity you know well she's standing here waiting for the mv32 I should get here in the next 15 minutes, so I'm going to wait for it. Because I was not going to take by the L train anyway. I was not going to take by the L train, so... Oh, the bus is about to turn. He's on. He's in Williams. He's not that far. Yeah, the bus is about to turn right now, though. Yeah, so all boys have this issue with the down there part. So I'm not even worrying. People looking and whatever. They need to mind their business. No, no, and there's nothing wrong with a person wearing a, a guard to protect themselves, you know? You feel me? There's nothing wrong with that, and people looking and staring. And feel. So sometimes they need to mind their business because it's not it's nothing important. It's not even that serious. I wear a guard because I'm protecting myself out here because people kick people in the jungle area, and I don't want that shit to happen to me. So that's the reason why I'm wearing a guard to protect myself. So there's nothing wrong with that, though. There's nothing wrong with that because I'm wearing a guard to protect myself. There's nothing wrong with that. I'm about to pass my gas, excuse me. I, I need to pass my gas, I can't hold it in. I tell people it's not even that serious and they wanna make it a serious thing. Not even that serious. You know something too, it was not even that serious because you talk about, you talking about all oh, this and that, you making forced comments or whatever like that. You don't know those kinds of situations, you know? And you making forced comments about them. That's not, you know? But I tell you, Fight Fest Production is an open, it's called Open Wall. We open people, we open up to every community. Oh, if you're LGBTQ, Q, Pride, we open to y'all too, you feel me? We don't discriminate, we don't judge, you feel me? Because I'm a heterosexual and I don't judge, you feel me? So that's how it is, that's what it is, you know? We come through with life, prosperity, and dreams happening, you know? 
we ain't coming, we ain't coming with negativity and all that. You feel what I'm saying? Said nothing wrong with that, you know? Like, people need to mind their motherfucking business and shit like that, because nobody not talking. That's the end of the day. It, it's, it's an issue where people want to be in people's argument and shit, and they don't know when to shut up. That's the problem, you know? There's nothing with a person wearing a guard. There's nothing wrong with that. Ain't nothing wrong with that. So, you, you like, you talking mad shit, you need to shut up and mind your business. That's the only thing right there. Because y'all talking about, all oh, this and that, oh, that person have an issue. It's not that the person have an issue. It's you don't need to know how to mind your business. That's the problem. That's what it is. You can't, like, you can't, you can't, you can't stand here and you can't wait for the bus in peace and they want to talk and shit. That's the problem with that. They don't know when to mind their business and shit like that. That's the issue. But nobody not speaking to them, and that's the problem. You know, there's nothing wrong with a person wearing a guard because they're protecting themselves. The like people kicking their jungle area and shit like that. They ain't, they're protecting me. I, I ain't worrying. I ain't worrying. So everything Gucci with me, I'm not worrying. You know what I'm saying? That's what I'm trying to tell you. I ain't worrying though, because you 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 talk about all this and that. You you not you not making everything easy. You making it uh, you making the situation even harder because you don't even understand the person's situation. And you wanna make you wanna make some you wanna make some false comments. Alright guys, I'm about to go on the B32. I'm about to head up there. So the next way is bird buses in 43 minutes. That ain't that some shit, right? Alright, I'm about to head over to the next location. I'll see you guys in the next video. Alright.